everyone. This is Mike Marshall, editor in chief of EssentialClicks.com. I wanted to share with you today a product that was featured on our blog, EssentialClicks.com. It's called cPanel for Newbies. Uh, the first thing that I want to say about this is that I think they named it wrong. Uh, it should actually be cPanel for everyone uh, because whether you are new to cPanel or you've been using cPanel for a couple of years, there's still quite a bit to learn here about the cPanel hosting interface. Um, for those of you who aren't quite sure what cPanel is, cPanel is a back-end administration control panel for uh, hosting your websites. Um, most major hosting providers out there today are using cPanel. Um, however, some of your uh, older hosts, such as GoDaddy, are not. They're using their own uh, kind of bland interface without a lot of options. Um, I'm not putting down GoDaddy. I highly recommend them for domain registration and domain management. However, when it comes to hosting my sites, I prefer a cPanel host. Uh, my favorite being HostGator. So now that we're past that, I want to talk to you again about the product here, cPanel for newbies. Um, the first thing that you can really say about it is that it's not some crummy ebook like they used to put out years ago uh, and flood the market with just written information that was hard to connect most of it was copied the cPanel for newbies is a video series um, they teach you how to use cPanel much in the same way that the video professor you see on TV teaching you different software programs uh, teaches theirs cPanel for newbies teaches you cPanel for newbies for advanced users even through a video style. Um, some of the topics that they cover are MySQL databases, um, AW stats, uh, how to do redirect uh, on your error pages, how to keep people from snooping, uh, alternates to FTP, how to do a backup and restore, how do you install server scripts, um, how to use cron jobs and Fantastico, how do you set up a cron job? Uh, you have loads of files on your site that need protecting. How do you hide them? They take care of that. How do you get rid of spam and spam emails? And how do you transfer files from one server to another? Uh, those are all covered in cPanel for newbies. Um, you know, for an inside look here, there are video tutorials within most cPanel interfaces, so they do show you that they have the basic tutorials there to help you, uh, but they also go into more advanced things like MySQS databases, or I'm sorry, MySQL databases and tables, um, using AW Stats. Uh, AW Stats is one of my favorite tools because it tells you. Uh, where your visitors are coming from by IP and country. Um, it can also help you pinpoint junk visitors and help you find ways to get them uh, off of your site. Fantastico is, in my opinion, the greatest thing within cPanel because it allows you to install uh, scripts from the server side such as WordPress or Joomla or PHP BB3 so whether you want to install a blog or a content management system uh, or a, a forum site you don't have to have any technical knowledge to do that when you have Fantastico here in your cPanel uh, it'll actually install those scripts for you uh, right, right on the server side that's that's just wonderful and that's probably if you haven't used Fantastico the video that you'd want to pay very close attention to uh, the next one is uh, how to do a 404 redirect uh, disabling indexes this allows you to uh, protect the files so that people can't get to them unless they're supposed to uh, cron jobs it's uh, basically to automate different tasks that your servers scripts require um, using file manager um, file manager is basically a built-in FTP client in cPanel so if you don't have access to an FTP client uh, wherever you might be but need to make a change to your website all you really need to do is log into your cPanel and will allow you to upload download and edit files that are stored on your server um, also there's email authentication 
which uh, will teach you how you can protect your email boxes from spam. Um, very important here is how to back up and restore your website. Quite often, uh, we don't have a fully updated version of our website saved to our hard drive on our PC that's only on the server. So this allows you to back it up, save it on your desktop, and be able to restore it at a later date and time. Um, it also gives you server-to-server -server transfer information, how to block unwanted users, and how to turn off SPF to protect your emails from spammers. Uh, the, the obviously hands-down thing that they offer here is an ironclad risk-free iron risk guarantee. Uh, if you're not completely satisfied, they will give you your money back. Um, basically, there are a total of 14 videos here, including the bonuses. Um, so, 14 videos for the price of $27, which was originally $47. I don't see how you can go wrong. Uh, you've got 60 days to ask for your refund if you're not happy with it. So that's two months to use these 14 videos and and try to become more so of an expert or more comfortable with cPanel. I don't see how you can go wrong on that. I myself guarantee that you will learn at least $27 worth of information uh, about cPanel that will be to your advantage. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to contact us at our blog at EssentialClicks.com. Again, the product that we were taking a look at today was called cPanel for Newbies, and it is featured at our blog. And it's available for download for $27 only with a 100% 60-day money-back guarantee.